Hello, one and all, to another Let's Play Dwarf Fortress. My name's Vertnox, uh, otherwise known as Mr. Vertnox for your feeling formal, and welcome back to I Believe, which is going to be episode 16, if I'm not mistaken, and we are going to be continuing our adventure in Dwarf Fortress. I did say that I felt like I was going to take a break for a while, but uh, some more ideas popped in my head, which always happens when you play Dwarf Fortress. Something new to do, and something more to uh, th um, always construct. So, here we are. Last time we left off, we had a were creature, uh, roughly about right here, um, a were badger which is attacking our human caravans, which I have no idea why it took so long for them to leave. Maybe they're the reason why the uh, fort was not, uh, why the trader caravans kind of messed up. Well, before we begin, I'm gonna go ahead and redo my home base. Because uh, remember the last time I left off, home base got royally screwed over. Alright, because I deleted it by accident in this menu. I think I had del delete key by accident. And we're going to use some tips that we've learned in the previous episodes about how to make multiple up and down burrows. First, we got to get everything upstairs. So they... So we got a lot of an a lot of adamantium gear by now, which is good. All right, that, I forgot to cover that. I don't know. Probably didn't have to cover that. All right, now we got to get more area up here covered. Do 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 do. -do. Turtle power. I don't know where that came from. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I don't want to get copyrighted infringement for seeing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. You know, I don't think anybody really cares if I sing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I have no idea why that's in my head. Has it anything to do with the Were Badger? Maybe. I don't know. Alright. Uh, we're almost... I'm going to get my nice set up included in my home base depot our little torture chamber here for our military alright how to connect this so the burrows are contiguous actually I don't think you have to they actually may uh, walk from one end to the other alright alright I just don't want any dwarves running out to the were beast while he's in were form. He'll he'll go away shortly, but uh, I you don't really want to risk it. Generally, smart thing to do is burrow everybody. You know I don't think anybody's been using my will. I don't. We hadn't had any uh, hospital victims to actually. Um, worry about her we're getting a lot of trash alright but I'm gonna go ahead and link it to anyways it's just in case they want to get a drink of water for some own, own, own reason alright you can get there now the hard part uh, da -da -da, da -da -da. the stairs alright there was a trick Select one square, and let me make sure. Oops, yeah, that was it. Basically, you press enter on one level, go all the way down to the oh, I screwed that up. Oh, 
I screw that up again. Uh, I must have like put it one corner. All right, let's try this again. All right, so that did all the stairs all the way up and down. See what I did? I clicked on one and then just arrowed down. Oh, that's no, not what I need to make one stop so they can. Our tracks have gotten bloody for some reason. so they can have access to the gold. Uh, it's cleared out. I don't know if they'll need access to this, but we might. We might have to get more gold when we're thinking about it. All right. And my train tracks I need to actually add to the burrow too because if the cart gets stuck in the middle, somebody has to go up and push it. Let me just back out of here for just a second and just make sure this is all cat blood. Cat blood, cat blood. Cat blood, alright. So it was just a cat dead. Not No doors were harmed in the process of... I deleted a burrow again by hitting... I thought it was D to define. That's all right. It was a not in Fortin Borough that I deleted this time. Luckily, hopefully I will not do that again. All the way downstairs. So we have access to the Magma Forge, of course. Screwed that up, didn't I? Alright. Now, well, the two areas that we need are, of course, our. Magma Forges. And our industrious areas where we're getting our adamantine our adamantine 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 I don't know don't need to get in there do need to get to here We need to get into here. And we need to get into here. And of course we need to get to here. I don't really wish they would move that delete key somewhere else or give you a confirm. It's deleting your burrows is one of the most annoying and F bomby kind of things that uh, could happen to anybody in their illustrious fort. I don't really need. We 
got plenty of stuff here. While I'm down here, I need to I'm gonna add another. Hmm. I was wondering if that would promote that to the top. Anyways, I don't know. I wonder if you could copy Burroughs. That'd be awesome if you could. Uh, you can't, though. All right. While I'm down here, I'm going to D for dig. Alright, that's all I'm going to dig for now. I'm not going to get too adventurous until we've pulled all that out of the, uh, oh. Help if I actually assign my military to the borough. So I go M, A, and we're going to go siege and home base. No. Inactive. Inactive. Siege. Home base. And I hate the way this is highlighted. Ah, damn it. Alright. Alright. Delete that. And one we'll pause it. Let them go to town. Give me just one second while we're waiting on this to uh, grab something really quick. Thank you for waiting. All right. Let me check on you on our And it looks like our guest has left. SpongeMan. Let me see if uh he's still on the map. Is he the diplomat? I don't know. Well, the were beast is gone, according to our you. I don't see any other things other than all these merchants. I'm really upset that the merchants kind of collapsed on us last round. Uh, let's go back to military alerts, set the inactive, and resume. Build that door. Gold door. All right. One well, now, one project I wanted to work on while we were waiting, besides road construction. All right, so that's back. Is we're actually going to be building a some goblins. Oh, they need to really clean that up eventually. But unfortunately, I think it's considered outside. I don't care what the doors want. The door is trying to let me know what the, the fort, the home base wanted. So this is considered outside, so it's not going to get cleaned up. That might get cleaned up. I don't know. I could clean up by building a shell over it. One of the projects I wanted to do was actually make some fortifications for my archers to actually have some place to shoot uninvited guests to come to our fort. So let me get started on that. So I was going to dig this out dig this out and we've dig that I know the home base guys annoying me all right so we're going to dig and while we're at it going to clear those ramps out. I, I don't think they... This is a 
to remove ramps. I don't. I don't think they necessarily have any negative. Like I don't. I think they can shoot through them, but we're just going to give them a clear line of fire. All right. Resume. Let them dig that out. We got a bunch of miners now. So we a lot of these projects are getting out, especially the construction projects. We got a lot of masons running on that. And let me check one thing though. The yarn. That's one thing I really wanted to make with some yarn. All right, so they're in the process of making because we were running low, as you see, on but just by on the stop pot, we're running low on clothes, uh, free clothes for people to actually wear, and we don't want that to happen because that that means they, uh, I don't know, they'll get upset because they have naked, they're naked. Oh God, forbid, naked dwarves. They get embarrassed and then they go berserk and kill everybody in big spir spiral tantrum. Oh look when the children is helping dig out. On occasion children will actually become useful and dig stuff out for you. Alright. Um, let me make sure of something here really quick. Shell one, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, I kind of did that wrong, but that's fine. We I make sure that huh. apparently that's I don't know, there's some open space there. That is considered inside subterranean And all right, one, two, three, one. I'm just making sure it's got a roof over its head. Yeah, it does. All right. So I want to have a ceiling, even if it's made out of mud. Uh, we don't want people like breaking in. Alright. Alright. Um, B for build, C for construction, and I'm going to do capital F for fortification. Make some shell fortifications there. I'm kind of really peeved about not getting all that stuff from the. Uh, I built a lot of cups for the dwarven caravan. I don't know why they uh, decided not to trade and they just kind of blew up and. I'm half con thinking about confiscating all their goods. That might piss off the doors. The base of the way to do that is deconstruct the trade depot while they're on it, and they will lose all their goods uh, that are are currently sitting on it. All right. Um, I guess I had to go get a a rock to place there. All right. Let me just make sure this is inside, inside. I wonder what kind of material this is. I don't know. What's beneath the grass? It doesn't matter because, like, this is, or that is, whatever is down there. Um, so that's technically underground. As long as we're. I'm just worried that there's a roof overhead. And there is, as long as we build to right about here. And. Alright, I'll wait for them. I believe that's a rock they're bringing to uh, construct the fortification. 
basically I'm making a little fortifications or things like I built up here like I showed you in the previous episode where they can stand next to it in a in a uh, dwarf can stand next to it and then um, shoot arrows down and hit people below and we're just going to build like a little area right here so the archer dwarves can all right BC capital F fortification and we're gonna build out a shell so the, the archer dwarves have a little place to shoot people as they're coming into the fort and I was thinking of this myself what's the point of having archer dwarves and they're not being useful um, we're gonna actually build, dig a trench that's why I didn't build it directly on the side here because I'm gonna build a trench so that dwar like uh, being attacked by giant crows. Hmm. I don't know. I need to make sure that uh, our the were badger. Let's see what he's. Let's see what the were badger has done. Uh, the axe dwarf. I don't know. Somebody was fighting with the. Uh, There's no recent announcements. So I don't know. All right. So we're, and once we dig the build that, we're gonna dig a trench, uh, one deep, clear out the ramp so they can't get it there. Oh, there, there goes the caravan, useless bastards. All right. It looks like they're finishing up there. Hopefully, we'll get the road built in order to uh, actually have them use the roads in the f for the future reference, so we know they all come in from one direction. Uh, yarn trousers 10 have been complete. Alright. So we got a lot of trousers. Hopefully they'll be. It looks like they're grabbing them as quickly as they're being made. Which kind of sucks. I don't know. I, I'm kind of avoiding. I need to buy more. That's why I, need, I probably should have confiscated goods from the. Uh, the caravan. It's just stole it from them been a bastard. I don't care. Alright. We'll survive another year. Well, we can survive without meat. We can survive. They can eat They can eat the raw plants if they have to. Alright. Pear easy meal. Pear. We got tons of chickens. Our fort's humming along nicely. We could use some... Uh, we could survive a siege or two. What are they doing down there? Are they just leaving off that side of the map? I don't know why the caravans are moving one way or they going the other way. Uh, shift D. I'm just saying. Uh, I probably should clear out some trees. Just to uh, make it more passable for the uh, caravans. I got a complaint, a comment said I shouldn't be using, like before I got my magma forges, I shouldn't be wasting charcoal on um, making armor. Well, let me tell you something. And then these new version of Dwarf Fortress, wood is not a, uh, a rare commodity. You will, it, like, I have too much wood. There's too many trees on this damn map for me to actually, they're, they're growing so fast that they're getting in the way of my caravans so I've got a ton of wood even if I didn't have any trees you can trade the caravans for wood and have almost an endless supply it's like wood is just basically uh, I, 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 almost unlimited quantity alright let's dig that trench so D to dig H for channel da, 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 dig channel and dig it there And I'm going to dig it over there. All right. All right. So we're going to have a little nice channel. It's raining outside. One of the doors are getting upset because it's raining. They're chopping down trees. We got like... I don't know if we have enough room in our stockpile. Let me add another wood stockpile because we're gonna have a lot more wood when we cut down those forests 
What if the elves will get upset at us? No matter, I can slaughter elves. Um, all right, so we dug channel that out. I need to remove the ramps. All right, because we don't want the ramps. We don't want them because you can still stand on ramps. Uh, all right. Oh. Oh dear. All right, I made a boo boo. I forgot to look where I was going. All right. Hmm. I really screwed the pooch. Um. All right. Let me. D X. All right. If I get a. <laughs> if I get a. Uh, if I get an invasion now. I'll be so... This is what you should do <laughs> when you... <laughs> Alright. Alright. Um, I really screwed the pooch on this one. Alright. Um, B for build. C wall. Alright. We need to make some walls. Kind of quickly. Oh dear. If we get an invasion now. <laughs> yeah, you need to watch where you dig sometimes. All right. I'm just quickly building a uh All right, I got him built one off. Built the other. All right. Um, yeah, the dwarf got confused. All right, so it looks ugly, but uh, I um, yeah, I should have been watching where I was digging there, but. Uh, we could have some serious fun if the invade an invasion came. All right, let's D for designate, and we're going to remove upstairs ramp Z. We're gonna leave one ramp so you can get up and down from this little area. But we don't want the people being able to get directly on the. on the uh on the ramps themselves and doors have to go around the little hallway there that, that's fine i don't really worry about that much so they're going to clear out those ramps and yeah clearing out the ramps so we got a nice barrier that prevents uh, goblins, well, any unit can shoot through, and this includes goblins. Goblins can also shoot through fortifications that are standing right next to them. Now, if you build a, build a pit where you can't stand there, only the people on the side of the fortification can get access to shoot the uh, goblins. And I... Do I want more? One, two, three, four. Hold on. I don't think we could add another fifth one out here without building a roof. No. That's fine. I, there's the fifth dwarf will stand here. One, two, three, four. Hmm. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. 
I take that back. We we probably want them to stand right here. Is this underneath something? Yeah, all right. We need to make space for the fifth dwarf. Uh, D to dig. All right, uh, back out. D to dig. It's possible that there won't be like five dwarves at a given time, but uh, you never know. I feel like filling this wall in with a wall so we don't have space down there. I'm going to do that because I'm so anal. They'll build the rest of that wall there. I don't know. It's not going to really make a difference. All right. And we got a little trench there. I guess you can make trench fortification systems. I don't know. All right. Build fortification. C. Oops. Floor. F is floor. Capital F. Alright, I want to make it out of shell. Alright. So we'll have one place for each of the dwarves to stand. Uh, in case they're... W nor, well, they don't all, sometimes all five don't come at once, but hopefully they will in this situation. Uh, all five dwarves will stand at the They'll have a space for each dwarf. I, I don't know if they'll stand on top of each other. Uh, what was that Z about? Uh, need wafers. Need wafers. All right. It's const constantly complaining we don't have enough wafers. Uh, let me check our forge. We got four. They're smelting gold. Um... Oh, well now that I got one other forge set up, add new test. We'll melt, melt metal objects. So we had a bunch of metal objects we wanted melted. And I was going to make some silver spinning, uh, silver serrated discs. Um, and I and I wanted to actually export those as high good product. I don't know. Maybe we should keep silver. I was just something we had a bunch of extra material. We had a bunch of extra silver, and I don't really want to build silver statues uh, since we're everything's golden. Uh, we want to stick with golden. There are these. Uh, build more doors. All right, that's good. Build D. As soon as that. Uh, All right, we need to make some more gold statues for our count who's going to do we have cabinets yeah we're gonna let's see uh, build cabinet we'll place it here because he wants cabinet if I recall correctly they want and he's going to have everything in gold. This guy is going to be so posh. He's got gold statues, gold chests. Um, and he's going to have a golden armor stand. No, we got salt peter stand. Oh, that's weird. We got a salt peter stand for some reason. I thought that was a golden one. All right. And his golden sarcophagus, which actually should place... Uh, Build and for barrier receptacle. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right. Gold sarcophagi. Is that even? I don't know. That that room just looks off. And we need another golden door, if I'm not mistaken. Um, back downstairs. Cancel these tasks. 
Add new task. Furniture, gold. We need another gold door. And we need the gold. We need a weapon stand, a weapon rack, two weapon racks, and two golden armor stands. We can make gold crutches. I guess if we want to make some posh. Um, Posh hospital people. And one reason I haven't really made a hospital, even though I should, is because of the antimantium issue. They like to take threads um, and sew them into casts. And I, and I, I'd rather my dwarves suffered a little bit instead of using such a precious material. All right, need for designate H2 channel. Hold on just a moment. I need. Well, I'm going to let this run for a second. I need to double check something really quick. Uh, I'm sorry for cutting away again. I'll be right back. We need to let this run anyway for just a moment. I'm terribly sorry about that. Um, tell you the truth, I l was hearing uh, sounds that somebody in the next room was watching one of my shows on Netflix, and I was very angry because if they watch the show, then it messes up my. And this is I was watching Battlestar Galactica. All right, and I'm gonna remove the ramp here. And there's like a gazillion episodes and I just finally found and, and I don't know why Netflix does this on, on Roku it says like episodes 36 so I was at my girlfriend's house and I was watching episode 36 okay so I remembered it I got home and I had to count the damn episodes to get to episode 36 I finally got it set and then I come home and somebody's watching it and I'm like don't watch it it's gonna ruin my queue again I'm sorry and and there the thing was they haven't even started what it makes me I'm getting nerd rage here anyway and the, the other thing was that they were watching it at the where I left off and I asked them not to do that because I I don't know and I don't know <laughs> I'm just so angry because <laughs> they they. Uh, they're going to lose my place. And they haven't even... I know this person has not seen 36 episodes. And there was no there was no reason them for to be watching episode 36 when they haven't seen the rest of the series. And I was like, don't don't watch it, please. Don't ruin my, my cue. All right. Uh, all right, they're making their dig. All right, so you can see here we've got our nice... And I'll make a little... Um, A little zone. Uh, so when they do come, they'll stand here. Goblins will try to walk through the fort, and then they'll just pelt them with arrows when they come. So I'm hoping to get an invasion soon. Um, let me just make sure something works first. Yeah, I, I'm sorry for that pause. That was just making me so angry that they were watching. I could hear the theme song, and I was like, what the fuck? I'm sorry for dropping the F-bomb there, but I'm, I was, I don't know. 
I should be all right. I was just test. I was just testing out to see if that lever worked. Sometimes it's good to actually test the, if you remember you set the lever or not. Add test P to pull. All right. So that's good. So we got we got our um, we got a little fortification, and I'm making sure that there's no. Uh, there's a cobalt thief trying to get in. Are they trying to sneak in? All right. If they come in the hall. I will send the archers after them. I don't know. I'm not really too worried about that. Um, let me just make sure I'm I'm just looking at the right area here. All right. All right. I'm just making sure there's no way anything can get in through the roof all right um, all right so we got our all right uh, if he doesn't leave I'm gonna send some archers after him. All right, he's leaving. All right. So he's gone. All right. Um, our stockpile looks great. Having around 2,000 some drinks. I needed to make some more statues. That's what I was thinking about doing F7. Cancel, 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 cancel. Uh, furniture, gold. We need four more gold statues. So that are. We'll have awesome setup, an opulent throne room. If your throne room's not. Uh, what? Hold on. What is this? What is this? Shell cabinet. How'd that get there? I specifically told it to. All right. We want the gold cabinet. I saw two gold cabinets. Uh, we got an ambush. All right. Um. Uh, da, 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 invader. It's only four. All right. Military time. Military alerts. Go to. Um. All right. We're going to go to siege alert, and I need before I unpause. Make another burrow. W for burrows. A to add. We'll uh, enter to define, not D to define. I don't know why I'm keep on thinking that. And uh, we'll call this. Uh, call it firing line two. I don't know what to call this. Um, archer nest. We'll call it archer nest. I don't know. Alright, let's... set that. we got archer nest set up. B, B for build. D for door. Grant door, I don't know, just in case there. And I'm going to make sure the home home base includes uh, enter to define 
so doors can walk through this. And, but they'll probably get scared if they see the uh, goblins to the fort slits. All right, now I need to go to M for military. Go to schedules. I need to go to siege. I'm gonna use the plus and minus to get the to siege. Going to go over to somber paddles with a O to give order. We'll defend. Uh, Archer Nest, and we'll give C to copy, B to paste, 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 and they're 10 minimum, so we're good. All right, so let's go to A to alerts, go to siege, turn on the somber paddles. I'm turn on the granite roars too. I don't remember what I had them set to. Hold on. What, what, let me go back to military. Somber paddles, I guess, was the only one we had to need to turn on. I don't think there's anybody left in the granite roars, so they're pretty much dead. All right. While we're at it, um, I'm going to pull the lever just to make sure they go through the traps. All right. So if they come in, they have to go through the traps. All right, everybody's rushing back in because they don't want to die horribly. Our uh, goblin friends are killing the uh, cats and other wildlife first. That's sometimes good for... Uh, they killed the ducks. All right. What was this? A snatcher. I saw, well, he's going away. Everybody should be inside. What are the goblins doing? Alright. Our guys are rushing to the defense. Goblins are... Charge! Do, do, do. And the archers have their war dogs with them. Are they all stacked in the same spot? No. Yeah, they are. <laughs> I wonder if that causes any problems. All right. Here comes the... the it's only like a four-man ambush. This is not really that exciting. This is not exciting at all. All right, it could be worse, I guess. All right, come on, hurry up! All day. That's why I should have got the rest of the military set up. All right, as they come in, they're kind of cautious. They don't want like they don't expect. I guess there's five, not four. I wonder why it showed four to begin with. All right, here you go. Fire! Shoot! Shoot! Uh, missed. He's been shot. Shoot, 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 shoot. Goblins dead. Dead goblins. That's the end of them. Oh, they get some practice out of it. He's dead. Or they're going to kill him. So that's a good thing I built that fort defense. I guess they could have ran in the traps and we could have captured some. But, you know, I, I kind of could have. Kind of could have, would have, should have. Maybe let them have traps. I wonder if these guys got any throw the kills on them. Took joy in slaughter lately. That makes happy archers. All right. Let me see if we still have any more goblins left. Yeah, we do. He's been injured. I don't know. Should we send them out to kill him? What's the other main major? All right, so they're they're wounded. All right. Um, let's hit O. Uh oh. S for squads. B for summer paddles. K to attack. 
Alright, kill the goblin pikemen now. And they they'll leave their default place and rush out. I think that that he'll get away though. Yeah, he's he's injured, so he's kind of snatcher. Where's the snatcher? I don't see it. Oh, we got another cake. <laughs> he 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 ran into the cage. All right. Let me pause it so I can see where they're going. All right. I get the goblin pikemen. All right. They're shooting the goblin pikemen down. He's injured. He's. If I go to R, let's see what the pikemen's flying. The flying warboard strikes the goblin lower body, tearing the muscles and tearing through the guts. The goblin pikeman looks even more sick. Wall boar bolt large firmly in the wound. The goblin gives in the pain. The goblin wretches vomit. So he's he's dead. He's gone. They're just pelting him to death. All right. And all right. So we did good job there. Let me pause it. And DT DBC DBC to reclaim claim his items. I think the other goblin ran away. All right, so we claimed the items. We got a lot of extra clothes out of it. Let me go downstairs to the rest of the goblin mess. So we killed two goblins? Three? I don't know. DBC. Claim those items. We got another goblin prisoner. All right. And I'm going to go to O, get or not O, S for squads, B for somber. We're going to cancel that order by pressing O. And I think we're safe. Let's go to you. Yeah, the other goblin is gone. All right. So we can go to military. We can go to alerts. We can set back to inactive. And we can turn our military back off. So everybody's everybody's happy. They they made some fresh kills. We got some goblin clothes and got a goblin prisoner out of the thief that tried to sneak in. Alright, we can let down the gates and everyone be merry again. Alright. P to pull the lever. And make sure no one's giving birth to puppies. Suture has been missing. All right, they'll probably find his body somewhere. Um, probably he died. All right, gotta make some more tombs here. BP, BP, BP. Sometimes, invariably, dwarves will be outside for stupid reasons. Probably he was fishing. That's why I make sure all of the dwarves that I really want alive don't have outdoor type um, thingamabobs so they don't go out dying. We got another snatcher. And I'm tempted to actually have them clean up uh, corpses from outside. So we got goblin corpses there, and that's just going to be a mess. And they're grabbing all the items. Goblinite, as that's called, it's an ambush. Another ambush. All right. Um, jeez, they don't know when to stop. All right. Uh, escape. Uh, eight alert. Alright, um, military, A for alert, go back to siege, turn on, back to the firing line, everybody go back inside. And now, go back inside now, and a war dog is going after a goblin. And he's attacking the cats, he gets caged. 
I don't know. They must be. They might be thinking about an invasion. And they just left. I don't know. They just. What are they doing? There's a dwarf up there. What is? I don't know what that dwarf is doing. Who is this? It was the woodcutter. He was probably outside chopping down trees. Now he's probably going, oh, dear God, I am, I am, he, he's dead. All right. Yeah, there's no ifs and buts about it. He's, they're going to murder him. So we got two goblins there. We still have our military. All right. I guess they ran out of ammo. Oh shit. Oh shit. And dwarf, he went down that way. Um All right. Um This is why we wanted that door closed. We might be making a military really quickly. Uh P to pull lever. All right, good. All right, <laughs> he he moved and he got shot at by the doors. All right, what are they doing? That that guy's just that one dwarf is actually fighting them. I did not tell you to go kill the dwarves. Why is he fighting? He's he was told to go outside and defend. Oh, what the hell? I don't know. My archers are being suicidal. Fight, fight. I don't know what they're. They're probably like fighting with a crossbow. They ran out of ammunition and they're fighting. All right, now they're still alive. They're just hungry. Unfortunately, I don't think they get ammunition when they run out. Either they're probably like low on ammo from the last from the last fight. They can't get through that way. All right, because um, there's a goblin in the way. They kill the goblin. Let me check the battle report. Morph Dwarfs, oh, he bashes, the, basically he bashes the goblin in the face with his his arm. So my Archer Dwarfs are, are kind of badass. All right, there's one invader left. And I don't know what he's thinking about doing. He's getting shot, shooting at him. They're fighting. All right, we got a mess here. And they're bashing, and he's probably bashing in the goblin with his. I don't know why they uh, went to fight outside instead of going to the depot. I I told him to, f to defend home base. All right. I don't I can't tell you what's going on. He the goblin is trying to get away. They're shooting him. All right. They're shooting at him. Shooting again. He's probably bashing in his head as we speak. They're kind of missing him. I wonder if they're actually hitting the <laughs> the dwarf behind it. Yeah, he's running back inside now. He's like, oh, what the hell? Oh, I'm getting shot. Now he's dead. What is he doing? I don't know. He's getting... All right. All right. So we successfully defended our fort. I wonder how that guy got in the trap over the... Or I guess they were carrying him. All right. Let's DT... DBC. DBC to reclaim 
claim all these items. And just because we got stuff outside, I'm going to change the order to uh, dwarves. We're going to gather refuse from outside just because. And I use the R and then the O button to get to that. Uh, I did O, R, and then O again. So they get the, they'll get they collect the bodies from outside. All right, let's go to military. We can stand down now. Hopefully, I don't know. We, we probably lost that Woods Dwarf. Uh, we we get we are bound to lose somebody. All right, so we're gonna set them back to inactive. And I'm gonna check on one more thing. Oh, schedule. And what was it? Siege, edit order. I'm the wrong one. All right. Uh, edit order. All right. All right. So I gave the wrong one. All right. All right. So everybody's back. We're going to um, clean up everything now. I wonder if our dwarf got killed. Yeah, the woodcutter's missing. He, he probably he probably bit the dust. Uh, do we have any more woodcutters? Yeah, they're out there. All right. Um, I feel like I should use some cats or dogs. Looks like there was some fighting going on here. Let me check. Is this the woodcutter? Oh, he's been mutilated. All right. I got some bunch of arrows around. Hopefully that'll be the last ambush that we're going to get for a while. Problem with the ambush is they sneak up and like a siege. When a siege happens, you have time to prepare. You you basically have a little bit of time to actually um, pull everybody inside. If an ambush happens, you get um, you kind of get blindsided right, and suspend that. There's not much you can really do with it either. Um, an ambush happens, an ambush happens, but hopefully we got to see some of our really awesome fighting skills going on there. Um, I feel like I should build more weapon racks for the Evan Rex. All right. Uh, let's see if we got any golden statues. Shell statues were useless. Oh, and our noble, and we got another mayor. They do not like to keep the same mayor. I looked at my nobles. It looks like we got a barony now. So, I think. Uh, you're out, and I gotta. Where's the mayor? He was a cook. Where is the mayor? Mayor, mayor, mayor. All right, 
let me check something really quick. I don't think I'm gonna have my mare die. He wants to make ballista arrows. No one, no one in the right mind is going to make ballista arrows. I guess we could. It may be something we should show you. Oh, looks like that guy died horribly in that uh, workshop that we. Yeah, well the uh, dwarf baby is still alive. <laughs> That's horrible. We starve the parent and their baby's still alive inside. We we should D for designate and uh, end remove construction. I guess we should make some ballista arrows for the new mayor. Um, make some more workshops. And we'll just... Cause, dang it. Because that's one thing we can probably make. I don't know. There's really not much in the way of. But I'm thinking I'm going to have that mayor. Is that lined up right? I guess so. It doesn't look right. I don't know why. To me it doesn't look right. It Nobles that want certain things. You know, I'm going to see if I can just replace the mayor. Because sometimes you can do that. I'm going to replace the mayor. You can't replace the barony, but you can replace the mayor. All right. Wait, before we do that, who was the who was the previous mayor? It was Stonecraft Atheldoran. Al All right. Now, you can do this if you really... Mayor makes you really... Here, there he is. He's back in business. All right, we basically prerogative of the noble. We basically have replaced the uh, mayor <laughs> and brought back the old. So he's not going to worry about the mandates. He just got shut down. All right, what does the baron want? Our export of battle axes, that's fine. We're not going to export any battle axes because we need those. Um... He is no longer any particular class because he no longer works. Um, we need to assign him a bedroom. I can assign him to our make bedroom. Assign bed. Assign bed. Where's there's the Baron? I don't know why it wasn't showing up. We'll give him both beds. Make him pretty opulent. What if that screws anything up? Probably not. You can sleep. You can sleep in both beds. You know. All right. I'm gonna sign them both, just so no one sleeps in the bed. He might get upset. If somebody gets in his bed, all right. This will be his dining hall. Make his dining room. Give that to the Baron. And this will be his throne room. Which he's got a table. All right. Let's see if he's got everything. What is he missing? All right. He needs. A tomb and weapon rack and armor stand. All right. That's why I built a tomb downstairs. Build door. Gold door. And he's going to have a pretty opulent tomb here. It's made of gold sarcophagi. All right. Assign tomb to the Baron. Baron's got his tomb, so he's happy. Or at least he's he needs weapon racks. Did we get those yet? Hold on. Beef build. 
Armor stand. Gold armor stand. I don't think we got weapon racks yet. No, I'm not going to build this. the uh, gold weapon rack. I'm going to build two gold because eventually he will want two gold weapon racks. When he becomes a uh, full-fledged count. All right, so we're cleaning out upside. We're going to have lots of clothes flow in. And we're cleaning up the dead bodies. And I make sure oh, that's being still constructed. All right, hopefully we won't have an ambush for a while. They'll, they'll cut out the past swath of forest. Yeah, as you can see here. We got a path now. Um, let me see here. I don't know. DB D smooth stone. All right, I'm gonna smooth these boulders out. They get in the way of caravans. Hopefully we won't get another ambush while we're waiting on that. Check downstairs. Let's check on our industry. Uh, we've run out of wafers again. Amentium wafers. All right, make that. Let's go to Z for our stocks. Thread. Adamantium strands. We got enough strands going on. I don't know why we stopped making the wafers. Gold cabinet that I was planning to add. F for cabinet. Gold cabinet. So he's got a pretty posh room. What's he doing? He's just hanging out. Got our cage prisoners upstairs. Goblins galore. Let me make sure I don't have my military alerts uh, inactive schedule. All right. They're just hanging out there for no good reason. Maybe they're just being cautious. You never know. Everybody's digging. DBC. Goods. Looks like we lost a lot of doors. Who is this? Uter. Apparently we lost a lot of doors. I don't know what what they were doing, but we lost some masons. I know I don't know where my adamantium strands are gone. I, I'm pretty sure I turned it off here. All right, let me just double check one of these. I'm gonna. It's T to see what's in bins. Or what? How do you see bins again? Is it K? Pigtail fiber cloth. Pigtail animatium strands. Oh, that's where they're at. 
told him to specifically not put the strands in the are we out of wool? No, we got we got wool. We got like two bins full of wool. Got a bunch of adamantium strands. I don't know why they're Oh, I know, because there, there's not a stockpile that's set. Could we turn off cloth? Or I got an idea. All right, go downstairs. D for dig. And let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I realize something. They don't, they don't put them in the right stockpiles. If they're, if you don't have a stockpile to put them in, they don't go in the right one. So I know why, because we had cloth disabled. So I'm gonna dig this out, make a stockpile, put it cloth, may adamantium only. So they'll bring it downstairs. It'll be close by. They want to run upstairs to actually uh, make the goods, make the items. Um, hopefully that'll prevent them from running around as far as 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 far the haulers can haul the stuff the people that actually make it can go near the right place all right uh weaponsmith has been possessed we are low on no we're not well we're kind of low all right we have that's not forbidden. I'm kind of happy with our with what our archer doors have done. Um, they were fairly effective in putting down our invasion or an ambush. All right, I'm going to build a weapon rack. Two downstairs weapon rack. Where's my cursor? All right, there. So they have room to put their weapons when they're off duty, which is right now. So we got all those goods. They're hauling dead bodies. Has claimed a magma forge. At least he was. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! He's he's taking gold and making something. I don't know. I really needed that magma forge to. I don't know make more all right make out of many wafers and this video is running long I may make this like a two hour video just because I don't feel like stop stop playing actually you know what let me make the stockpile, move everything down, and cancel the video because I realize that something blows up. I've done a lot. I've had a lot of fun, a lot of stuff to show off, um, interesting things going on, and I will do this in the next video. Uh, I want to make sure this is all saved and good to go. So, again, for, thanks for sticking with me this video for so long. Hopefully this has been entertaining, and I want to thank you for all for watching. Please feel to comment, any questions, any concerns. Always feel free to comment, even if it's negative. I, I, I'll still like to hear it. All right. Take care, and you everybody have a good night.